How's it going, everyone? My name is Dave, and welcome to another video. So one thing I have been asked consistently for a while that I never really thought to actually talk about would be my thoughts on like work ethic versus self-care. You guys are a little bit confused on this. Um, so, I'm the kind of person who is always like thinking, you need to take care of yourself above all else. And I'm not talking about like, when it comes to before this is brought up, go to work, you're taking care of yourself by doing, you gain money to be able to, no. I mean, when I say that, I basically mean that you need to be caring for your own health, in a sense, where it's like if you get cold or fever, stuff like that, stay home, take care of yourself, go to work, and you're completely healthy from that. Obviously, there are some cases where, you know, you get gotta try to avoid that and you have to go in, but to a degree, I've always felt that it's kind of ridiculous when people just go into work and don't you know, care for their own health, especially for those who have certain circumstances that emphasize on that. Not a lot of people pay attention to that kind of thing, that's where it kind of starts to bug me. Personally, myself, like, I'm going to take today, for example. Earlier today, I was... As of this recording, I was scheduled to work, and my, my throat had been blown out. I ate something, I waited a couple hours, nothing. Still nothing. But it got to the point later on in the day, it took about 12 hours before I was finally able to actually speak properly again. And I'm still trying to balance it out because I can still feel like a burn in my throat. Hence the several pauses. That being said, I still think that doing stuff like this, like resting, is basically what I've been doing most of the day. And I, I personally think that that's how I should have gone about it rather than going and going, okay, let's get to work. Because, first of all, the way I'm presented towards my job, most of it is me talking. And, well, I couldn't do that. There is cleaning as well, but to a degree, to a fault. I'd be standing around doing a lot of nothing most of the shift. If that was the case, and in the long haul... What would the point of that be? You're literally sitting there doing nothing, wait for the waiting for the next thing to happen. So I'm just like, you know what? I do get like I could have ch chose that because it's still working. And even if I did try to push my voice to the point where I could still try to talk, it would be a bad idea. And this is one of, like, many examples I can give. It's just the closest one I got, because it happened to me literally the most recently. Like, I could give an example of a cold. First of all, since we're supposed to be wearing masks all the time, if we're out because of the elephant in the room, um, those shouldn't matter. So that's what people say to me, but I'm like, yes, it does. Because say, I don't know, you're on a break and you're getting food. Are you going to try to shove it, shove the food through the mask or something? Take it off and cough and it'll spread like that. Now this is kind of towards the ones who care about their health. But when it comes to the elephant in the room, or for those who are wondering what I'm referring to, COVID,
I've noticed that a lot of people have a tendency to push what I'm referring to. Rather, go out and do things rather than care for their own personal health. I have actually lost a close friend. Not close-ish, I guess would be the better term. To that particular idea. And it's just upsetting. It's upsetting for me to see how many people out there do not care for their own health, and if they do, they don't act on it at all. I'm going to end this here, um, so I'm going to end up going on a rant, but that's my thoughts on, like, taking care of your health versus going into work. If you guys agree or disagree, or if you have any thoughts on the matter, let me know in the comments below. If you want me to talk about my opinion or personal life experience about something else, uh, feel free to let me know about that, too. Um, if you like this kind of content, consider subscribing to the channel, because I do one of these types of videos every three days. It's mostly gaming, but it's still this nonetheless. With that being said, want to check out more stuff like this? I have a link to a playlist where I talk about events about myself and things in my life right here on this side, and then... The discussion and rants videos that kind of go off on different random topics sometimes, that'll be on this site over here. In the meantime, though, I'm going to head out, but I'll see you guys in the next one. Bye for now.